from independence to 1970 and beyond. We were singing it, we were saying the pledge, but we were as corrupt and as evil as could be. Particularly my generation that sang it. I say you cannot. I say why? I say because I'm Dr. Pokey. I'm your friend Dr. Charles Apoki. a reflection of his thoughts. As a man thinks in his heart, so he is. African nations are a reflection of the collective thoughts of the people. Those who vote, those who are voted for, those who rig elections, those who falsify results. Recently, we, our president marked one year in office. And one of the achievements they will put up for next year is that we change to our old national anthem. Is the old national anthem our problem? Though tribe and tongue may differ, in brotherhood we stand. Didn't we fight a civil war? We fought a civil war. I want to appreciate one of our sponsors, Andor global foods this is the andor garlic powder this is andor ginger i used it this morning very nice this is andor turmeric powder you can either add them to your tea or add them to your food talking about food this is Andor dried catfish, one kilogram, delicious. You can see their phone numbers and their contacts beneath the video. Patronize Andor Global Foods, NAVDAC registered. All the tribalism and all the rubbish that occurred in this from independence to 1970 and beyond, uh, when, whenever they changed they change the national item, uh, anthem. We were singing it, we were saying the pledge, but we were as corrupt and as evil as could be. Particularly my generation that sang it. Most of those, those who reverted to the old national anthem are my wicked generation. Changing national anthem without changing the mindset of the people will not make any change. And I encourage you Nigerians, please, let's start holding our leadership to order. As the debate was on, people did not, people just allowed them to walk through with that debate. National anthem is not our problem. Hunger is our problem. Homelessness is our problem. Excessive taxation is our problem. Insecurity is our problem. The people who are even invading this country as bandits are not Nigerians. Even if, even if they are Nigerians, it still emphasizes, emphasizes my point that though tribe and tongue, being brotherhood, we stand and all that, does not change the mind of people. We need to re educate them from primary school. I hope that this gets to our people and will have a change. I remain your friend, Dr. Charles Apuke.